amazing ga uh, game engine to, you know, uh, streaming yet. Uh, on the other hand, it supported almost 200 people on bots last night uh, when we were playing it. And the version we have here can support even more. So, no, uh, it is not looking like the most beautiful or wonderful game right now, nor was it intended to. It is doing what we needed it to do now, which is get the networking down, get rendering speed, you know, uh, to where we need it to be. So we're very happy with that. How do you plan uh, from Balinor? How do you plan on combating craft the bots? Well, that's the beauty of this game. Again, you can't bot your character to sit there and make a thousand items. Won't work that way. First of all, you can't make a thousand items. Uh, not in a session, and even with the hyperbole there, uh, even dozens of items. That's not the point of this crafter system. So, is it going to be great for botting? No, actually it won't. Uh, question um, from uh, Rootbla. Can a non-crafter help out a crafter in a meaningful way? We certainly hope so. We think it's kind of important that they do. Uh, from Baman, will poison be a craftable item, uh, or will it be more like a class-specific skill? Well, in a perfect world, you would be able to um, uh, craft the poison, gather the material, I should say, gather the materials, then craft the poison and hand it to, over to somebody to use. Uh, can, uh, can we disassemble items created? Absolutely. Salvaging, learning the techniques, could be kind of useful. Uh, well, crafters, uh, can crafters hire NPC miners? That's actually something I've talked about or written in one of our documents. It's something we're thinking about. Uh, certainly, we don't want to start that way. Uh, but if we saw that we don't have enough crafters, enough people mining, would we consider it then? Yeah, absolutely. Uh, from Refried Beans, is there anything a crafter can't make? You never want to say never as a developer. Uh, and I've already said that some items are going to come free to new players. Uh, so, you know, I don't want to say that you'll never be able, you, you can craft everything in the game. Um, but the idea is that as a crafter, we are telling you folks that this is your game. This is not going to be us dropping a token system. This is not going to be us dropping high level items on you. Not now. And with the one exception that I have said for the underpopulated, if realms are terribly underpopulated and can't get either crafters or can't get materials, I'm reserving the right uh, for the king of each of those realms or any of those realms to help out. Other than that, no. Crafters are going to be making, you know, everything in the system. Uh, from uh, GBTV Troll, can you trade and sell souls? Uh, undecided in terms of your own souls, so don't captured souls, are going to be a good. Not a uh, great question, important one for you crafters. How challenging is it going to be to finding top tier ingredients without getting killed? Uh, certainly wandering around the frontier by yourself, uh, probably not a great idea. Uh, you will get killed. Um, but if you need to uh, wait, for example, for somebody to open up the depths, if you need to wait till your side captures a particular mine, that's how it's going to work. Crafters and combatants are going to have to work together, boys and girls. That is what we've said, you know, even before the Kickstarter, during the Kickstarter, and of course now after. Uh, Brash and Tell, can you recycle items or are they simply deleted? Recycle items. Uh, we want these items to count, to be something useful. Uh, so even uh, if it can't be enhanced anymore, you want to get rid of it, it has to have some value. Uh, Sinekin, no problem regarding uh, missing some questions. Can you scavenge raw materials? 
bulk of players and creatures, certainly uh, creatures. That's the, uh, the point of killing uh, certain animals, so you can skin them. Recovery from other players, that's something we'll talk about at another date. The only thing I will say is the same thing I've said before, this isn't a uh, full loot uh, PvP game. So you will not be able to loot other players and they will not lose all their stuff. Uh, Disco Duck, can crafters list necessary items in the bounty system? Yes, sir. Hey, uh, Gondrum, a uh, question about Caravan's inventory, already answered it. Um, uh, short answer is maybe. And uh, the long answer, of course, again, is that's something that we are talking about. Uh, Rathworth, uh, can a crafter not be useful in PvP, but at the same time survive running through the woods? Yeah, we're, that's absolutely what we're hoping. Uh, look, we don't want to make the crafter so weak uh, that a bit of wind or a rat uh, kills them. Uh, when I say that they can't survive uh, very long in RVR, sorry, PvP, um, that is very different uh, from being able to walk around the woods and uh, have to worry about a mosquito stinging them and them dying. That would be lame, that would be stupid, that would make uh, being a crafter or a gatherer uh, much more difficult than we certainly intend, so no. Uh, Paul, he said frontier. Uh oh, call mythic. Uh, I use the word frontier, I use other words, and I'll keep using them until you see the map display. Because if I talk about those words, that will kind of give it away. Uh, Odovic, will there be access to special box stations in the depths? Absolutely. It uh, was in uh, the story, wasn't it? Uh, lactose free. Can crafters expand and build keeps? Yes. Okay, last question coming up now. So I'm going to look for a really, really good question. Okay, I'm going to look for two really good questions because uh, I like this question. And then on, uh, we'll see what. Oh, God, now there's two questions I want to answer. All right, three questions. So the first question. Will the lunar calendar, certain days of the year, and diurnal cycle, as well as sites of power, POPs, and weather be factored into crafting? I'd love to be able to do that. Uh, question number two, will you be able to craft via a mobile app or something? Uh, we have talked about that already, um, not in this presentation, but in others. Uh, we absolutely could see a mobile component uh, to aspects of this game. Uh, we do not have one planned. It is certainly something that could be a stretch goal. So, looking for one really good question. And as always, folks, uh, questions only regarding crafting and questions that uh, I have already answered, I won't be answering again, right, especially right now. All right, here's one that actually it has to do with crafting and just off to a little bit, but it's one I haven't answered before. So, you know, I, frankly, I haven't been asked it before. Uh, from uh, Iskaril Pust, can you sell items as a non-crafter? And I think that's a great question because, frankly, our combatants, you know, need to know that. The answer is yes, of course you can. Uh, you can sell them to other players. You can sell them to crafters. Um, you know, if you want to get rid of your stuff or stuff that... Uh, you have, um, no, let's just say acquired, uh, you should be able to sell them. So that is it for right now. Um, 
as always, thank you very much. Uh, I hope you enjoyed the crafting uh, session. And um, hopefully I'll be uh, doing another Q&A later today. I know I've got other things in the schedule, including story time. So um, that's it, and I'll see you soon.